Okay, so for our barbell hip thrust, ISO hold plus reps, we're gonna need to set up with the bench behind us. Uh, if your bench is a light bench, uh, set up uh, some plates on the back just to make sure that bench doesn't slide back on you. Barbell is gonna be up just like this. I would recommend some type of a, a pad because the weight's not that heavy. I'm just gonna demonstrate this with a knee sleeve. I'm gonna place that right on my pelvis. I'm gonna ro roll that bar right on top of my pelvis. Now getting into starting position is the most uncomfortable part of the lift, but once you get there, everything's all good. So make sure that upper back is on the, the bench here. We're gonna bend our knees, get our feet nice and flat, and we're gonna perform a hip thrust up into starting position. From there, make necessary movements to the feet. Make sure that bar is nice and comfortable on the pelvis area. And this is gonna be our starting position. So we'll start here on that first rep. We're gonna come up and we're gonna hold for 20 seconds. We're gonna squeeze as hard as we can. I'm driving my feet through the ground. My knees are going outwards to activate the outer glutes here. My core is nice and tight. And even though this weight is not heavy, I can still feel my glutes working hard because of how hard I'm squeezing. So after that 20 seconds is up, then we're gonna go straight into performing the prescribed amount of reps. To get down on the, the, the bottom position, just lower yourself nice and controlled back down and let that ball roll back over you.